I'd just like to reinforce the concept of franchising as being a business format franchising. So when someone takes a franchise, they get a full business system, which includes a trademark, it includes training, it includes the right to use a very developed business system that's been proven and tested in the franchisor's market. And this is important for master franchising for the following reasons, that when you're bringing a concept from one country to another, the franchisor will want you to replicate that concept under its brand to make sure the brand image is sustained and the quality and service of products supplied is of the same level as it is supplying to its customers in its home country. A franchisor going into a new country has a, a number of alternatives available to it. It can introduce direct development by subsidiary franchising, set up its own corporate structure and grant franchises itself. A franchisee is given the right to sub-franchise within their country. So essentially the franchisor is taking their business, bringing it to, for example, the Indian market and saying, I need to find somebody here who's got the resources and who's got the willingness to learn my system and then reproduce it here in India.